Yutiao, also known as Chinese fried churros, Chinese cruller, Chinese oil stick, Chinese donut, yu char kue, kakwe, kakoi, kue, kwai in Malaysia, Indonesia, and Singapore, and fried breadstick, is a long golden brown deep fried strip of dough eaten in China and by a variety of other names in other East and Southeast Asian cuisines. Conventionally, yutiao are lightly salted and made so they can be torn lengthwise in two. Yutiao are normally eaten at breakfast as an accompaniment for rice congee, soy milk or regular milk blended with sugar. Topic: <culinary>, Culinary applications and variants. At breakfast, yutiao can be stuffed inside xiaobing, traditional Chinese, xiaobing simplified Chinese, xiaobing literally roasted flatbread to make a sandwich known as xiaobing yutiao, traditional Chinese, xiaobing yutiao simplified Chinese, xiaobing yutiao. Yutiao wrapped in a rice noodle roll is known as zalang. In Yunnan, a roasted rice flour pancake usually wrapped around a yutiao is known as shaowerkuai, traditional Chinese, shaowerkuai simplified Chinese. Shower. Yet another name for a sandwich variant is Janbingguozi, traditional Chinese, Jian Bing Guo Zi, simplified Chinese, Jian Bing Guo Zi, literally Yutiao and fried bread. Yutiao are used to dip into various soups, for example, Zidufan. Yutiao is also an important ingredient of the food Sifan Tuan in Shanghai cuisine. Tango, Tang Gao or sugar cake, is a sweet, fried food item similar in appearance to Yutiao but shorter in length. In Thailand, yutiao or pathongko, pathongko in Thai are eaten for breakfast with soy milk or porridge. In Cambodia, it's called chakve, and often eaten with kutiv, noodle soup, for breakfast. Names China Although generally known as yutiao in standard Mandarin throughout China, the dish is also known as guozi, guozi in northern China. In Min Nan speaking areas, such as Taiwan, it is known as yu chia koa, yu za guo where koa, guo guo means cake or pastry, hence, oil fried cake, pastry. In Cantonese speaking areas this is rendered as yao jaguai, yu za gui where gui literally means, devil, or ghost. Topic. Folk etymology The Cantonese name Yaojagwai literally means, oil fried devil, and, according to folklore, is an act of protest against Song Dynasty official Qin Wei, who is said to have orchestrated the plot to frame the general Yu Fei, an icon of patriotism in Chinese culture. It is said that the food, originally in the shape of two human-shaped pieces of dough but later evolved into two pieces joined in the middle, represents Qin Wei and his wife, both having a hand in collaborating with the enemy to bring about the great general's demise. Thus the Yutiao is deep-fried and eaten as if done to the traitorous couple. In keeping with the legend, Yutiao are often made as two-foot-long rolls of dough joined along the middle, with one roll representing the husband and the other the wife. Topic. Indonesia In Indonesia, the fried dough is known as kakwe pronounced takwe. It is commonly chopped or thinly sliced and then eaten for breakfast with bubur ayam chicken porridge or eaten as snacks with dipping of local version of chili vinaigrette or peanut, sat sauce. Topic. Laos In Laos, yutiao is generally called patanko cf. Thai patanko or chow ki, and is commonly eaten with coffee at breakfast in place of a baguette kao ji falong. It is also eaten as an accompaniment to kao peak sen, chicken noodle soup or jok, kanji. Topic: <laughs> Malaysia and Singapore. In Malaysia and Singapore, it is known in English as Uchar Kwe, Uchar Kwe, or Uchar Kwe, transliterations of its local Hokkien minin name Yuza Guo Yu Chia Koa. It is rendered in Malay as Kakoi, an alteration of the minin term Char Kwe. 
The Malay version comes with various fillings, which are either sweet, such as red bean paste or savory, such as sardines fried in tomato sauce. The plain version is usually eaten with coconut and egg jam kaya. Kakoi is usually sold in morning street markets or pasar malam night markets. It is also normally served with back cut teh, ru gu cha porridge or rice kanji, sliced thinly to be dipped into the broth, kanji and eaten. It is also commonly eaten with coffee or soy milk for breakfast. Myanmar <inaudible> 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 The Utiao is also a popular breakfast food in Myanmar, Burma, where it is called e kya kwe. It is usually eaten with steamed yellow beans with salt and oil. It is also usually dipped into coffee or tea. E kya kwe is also eaten with rice porridge or cut into small rings and used as a condiment for mohinga. Tea culture is very prevalent in Myanmar and every shop will serve e kya kwe for breakfast. Some shops stuff meat into the Utiao and deep fry it over again. It is called e kya kwe asar thut, stuffed e kya kwe. Philippines In the Philippines, the Utiao is called bicho, place bicho bicho, although this name can also refer to sweetened, fried dough balls similar to the buñuelo, also called cascarón. In the Visayan region, they call it sia koi, usually twined like a rope. Thailand In Thailand, Utiao is generally called Pathanko Thai, Pathanko pronounced -k due to a confusion with a different kind of dessert. Pathanko is a loanword adapted from either Teochew Minan Bay Tung Gwai, Bai Tang Guo Mandarin, Bai Tang Guo or Cantonese of Bok Tonggu, Bai Tang Gao Mandarin, Bai Tango. However, both possible original names are different desserts, not to be confused with the real white sugar sponge cake. Bai Tang It was previously sold together with Utiao by street vendors who normally walked around and shouted both names out loud. However, Thai customers often mistakenly thought that the more popular Utiao was Pathanko. Eventually, the real Pathanko disappeared from the market because of its unpopularity. Ironically, the disappearance of real Pathanko Leaves Utiao being called under the former's name, but the latter's real name is generally unknown amongst the Thais. But the original white sugar sponge cake can still be easily found in Trang province in southern Thailand under its original name. Both Thailand and Cambodia are relatively neighbors to each other. So this is how they both have similar cuisines and ways. In Thailand, Pathanko is also dipped into condensed milk or, in the south, eaten with kaya. Topic. Vietnam In Vietnamese cuisine, it is known by a name that is a mix of Sino-Vietnamese and native Vietnamese to achieve a pronunciation similar to the Cantonese name, as Do Chao Ki, Gio Chao Ki or simply Ki. Yu, Do, Gio, Gue, Kai, Ki, coming from the approximate Chinese name. In Vietnam, Gio Chao Ki is eaten typically with kanji, pho in Hanoi and sometimes with wonton noodle mi wonton. <laughs> Cambodia In Cambodia, it is called cha kue. In Cambodia, it is dipped in rice porridge, noodle soups like Phnom Pen noodle soup ku tiv, coffee, or condensed milk. In Australia it is sometimes called chopstick cake by some Cambodian Chinese immigrants because of its resemblance to a pair of chopsticks. See also Fried dough foods List of Chinese dishes List of donut varieties List of deep fried foods List of snack foods List of street foods Zalang See Fan Tuan Topic. Similar Chinese foods Ox tongue pastry Shuangbao Tai Other similar foods 
Bortzog from Mongolia and Central Asia Churro from Spain Cruller Beignet from New Orleans USA Tenkasu from Japan equals equals notes <laughs>